Hello, welcome to the video. I'm going to be testing out the RTX 4070 in Microsoft Flight Simulator 1440p. Um, we're going to probably do native and then maybe test DLSS out as well. Uh, but these are the settings. We're in 1440p. Um, and then everything's just going to be completely maxed out ultra. Uh, these settings up here, the detail settings on the, on the ultra preset. And then everything else is uh, completely maxed out. Uh, so let's take a look. Right, so here we go. Um, this is one of the activities on there, just the preset, uh, like flight maps, I guess, where you can just have a quick look around. This is Bora Bora. Um, but as you can see, 1440p here, we're over 60, which is good. Handles this well at 1440p, really. Under two, just under 200 watts. GP power, VRAM's fine. Just over half. easily playable you could probably push even playing this game 4k with using like frame generation or something you could probably get away with that as well and i think we probably i doubt we drop below 60 here as well i'll i'll check out the um that new york map as well because that usually lowers my frame rate a little bit but pretty good really Hitting almost 80. Right, so slightly lower FPS on this map, as I, I said there would be. Uh, this map seems to generally get lower FPS on this map. Still holding just above 60. I think we might dip below it as we get into the city. Using over 200 watts now as well. VRAM's up to 9. That's like 3 or 4 higher than the other map. There we go, 56, I just saw. So, quite a bit lower FPS than the other map. Obviously, you've got all the, the buildings. You've got more, more on this map than the other one. For the most part, over 60. Well, uh, let's try... We could try uh, DLSS and frame generation. Oh, the, the settings are really annoying on this. Um, so if we put that on quality and frame generation, see see how many see how many frames we get. Look at that, 130 over double. Huge, huge increase. You'd probably on that other map, that Bora Bora map, be seeing over 150. It's pretty incredible. Even we could try... Could try just switching... Just have frame generation on. That would give us a bump of frames. Over 60. There we go. Way over 60. So then you don't lose so much of the quality from the upscaling. But yeah, overall uh, pretty good. That's going to be it for this video, guys. Make sure to, to leave a like. Let me know what you think of the 4070. Is it good value or not? Um, I've been liking it so far from what I've played. Um, but let me know your thoughts. And I'll catch you in the next one.